it's just silent and echoing in here. You can see this one over here lighting up, but that's it. This is so creepy, guys. Let's see if it turns on when I walk. Okay, it's buzzing. The second one here is buzzing. And okay, now they turn on. That's what I'm talking about. Bring it to life! And now it's dead again. <laughs> oh my gosh. Alright guys, today we are in Middletown, Ohio at this Spirit Halloween that used to be an Elder Beerman. Look at the glass on the front of that building. That is pretty dang cool. And look at this, the sign is like way down there. I personally would have put that sign up on the top windows and then all the little posters on the bottom windows but it still looks totally awesome. All right, guys, let's go ahead in. I can't stop looking at this building. It looks so awesome. Let's go ahead in and see what kind of awesome stuff we can find in the Spirit Halloween in Middletown, Ohio. Look at these doors. What the heck, man? This is awesome. <laughs> it seems very, very quiet and spooky in here. Why the heck is it so quiet in here? Oh my gosh. I'm about to shake things up. Starting with this guy. Look, what the heck is going on with his arm? His arm is like, is it broken or is it just styled like that? I don't know. All right, Mr. Farquaad, I hope you get your arm fixed. All right, let's go on through here, guys. Wow, they are clearing out quick. We don't have a Grim. We don't have a Bog Zombie. Do we have anything in here? We do have the tubes of Bubbles of Death. Look at this. Holy crap. We got Barry here, and he's on a reduced price, $84.99, not able to be fixed. He is a sitting prop only. I wonder if good old Dr. Zombie could fix that prop. Guys, it is so spooky to be walking through here with it so quiet. The only thing I can hear is like the buzzing from these bubbles of death. So strange. Look at this one is pretty murky here. This one's really clear. This one's really clear over here. But this one over here is just perfectly clear water. It's not even running for some reason. All right, let's come on out here. Oh my gosh. I'll tell you, it is, it is just so strange and awkward to be in this store with it being so huge and it's so quiet. We don't have Shorty over here. We don't have a Punchy over here. It's, it's reminiscent of the new Spirit Halloween movie where they're in an abandoned Toys R Us. Ooh, we do have some animatronics for sale over here. Let's take a look at these. Look at this. We got a jumping spider that's 50% off because he doesn't jump. We also have a Nozzles the Clown here. Look at this. I'm like whispering because it's so quiet in here. How crazy. We got a Mr. Punchy right here. We got a Betty Sharp over here. Who do we have on this side? Another Mr. Punchy. We have Sinister Spirit Dolls. Oh, look at this. We have three Straw Mans. We got a Fogging Skull Pile over here on top of two Deadly Creepers. Is there something else over here? Another Sinister Spirit Doll. They actually have a pretty good handful of animatronics on the floor for sale, but they are pretty empty back in this department. I'm telling you guys, it's almost spooky. <laughs> All right, we got the jumping spider, but he doesn't have a uh, he doesn't have a pad down or anything, and apparently the sensor's not on. I hear a chainsaw. You guys hear that? Somebody's getting murdered by a chainsaw. Look, we have one bubble tube of death working over here, and this one is not even turned on. We got lucky bottoms over here. He apparently isn't on either. What the heck is going on in this store? It's even more scary that they're not working because I expect them just to jump up and scare me. Here we go. We got one that's working, guys. It's Nazi. Wow, he is super quiet. 
Somebody in this store does not like sound, I'll tell you that. <laughs> oh my gosh. Well, Nazi, you saved the day. All right, let's move on a little bit here because I do see that over here we have sandworm groundbreakers. We have deadly creepers. We have jumping spiders. Well, I am going to leave Nazi some stickers here. At least he gave us a little bit of entertainment. Let's go ahead through the tunnel of electrical death and see if it electrifies us. Look at this. This is so awkward. It's just silent and echoing in here. You can see this one over here lighting up, but that's it. This is so creepy, guys. Let's see if it turns on when I walk. Okay, it's buzzing. The second one here is buzzing. And okay, now they turn on. That's what I'm talking about. Bring it to life! And now it's dead again. <laughs> oh my gosh, this is so crazy. All right, guys, let's walk around a little bit, make our way around the store. I see some zombie babies down here, all four of the same kind, the crawling zombie babies, and we have a secret keeping cat. Excuse me, sir, what's going on in this store here? Please tell me, because I'm getting a little creeped out. Wait a minute, we gotta come back over here because I still hear that chainsaw. But where the heck is it coming from? It's like somewhere. It sounds like it's right here. It sounds like it's coming from inside. But if we come around here and we go through here, you can just barely even hear it in there. That is so weird. <laughs> Nazi, what is going on in this place? They got a bunch of the Killer Clowns inflatables here. We have the Killer Clown statue here. We got Sam greeters. We got Sam pillows. We got the Sam light up wagon here. We got Sam groundbreakers. All right, let's keep walking around in here. I'm curious what else we're going to see. We got a lot of bobble heads here. Bobble heads. We have a lot of side steppers here. We got the tabletop projection lights. We got these hanging ghouls over here. Those hanging ghouls over there. I'm curious to see what's on this side of the store over here. Here we got some plush from Beetlejuice. Hmm, I wonder if we will find the green Oogie Boogie. We got a bunch of inflatables over here. These guys are pretty well stocked, guys, in this store that has not a soul. Actually, there's a couple souls in here. <laughs> we do have the vintage Wolfman doll here, a couple of pumpkin nesters, a couple of Rosalies. Oh, and another vintage Wolfman. Creepy Crimson Girl on a Swing, as well as a couple of Swinging Witches. The Phantom Ghosts, which I accidentally called Handsome the other day. We have the Vampire and the Devil Door Knockers. Oh, look at this. We have a six-foot inflatable skull over there. I believe I own an inflatable skull in storage. We have the Coffin, the Ghost. We have a couple of Fright in the Boxes there. A Wolfman, Tombstone, Wolf, Haunted Tree. Let's see. Ghost Face. Scary Clown Archway, and the Scarecrow Archway, as well as the Jack-O-Lantern Archway. Which one of these is the biggest? That one's 9 feet. That one's 12 feet. Both of those are 12 feet on the bottom there. It is spooky in here, guys. <laughs> of course, it is a Monday afternoon. I was out yesterday at stores, and they were so packed that I could barely film anything because there were so many people. Look at all the donations, guys, for Spirit of Children. Thousands of donations on that wall. All right, let's take a little look over here because I can't ignore that I see buckets here that are crying for stickers. Let's look at the pops over here for a second. We got Chuckles. We got the Hocus Pocus Sanderson sisters. I'm creeping myself out because I'm like almost whispering because it's so quiet in here. Wait a minute, look at this. Usually they have this part blocked off. They have Young Crouchy on the inside and Tombstone of Terror on the outside, but here we can walk right through. How cool is that? Which way shall we go? Let's choose this way. <laughs> All right, we do have Monty over here, guys. We got Monty in his little circus cage, just 
just waiting to talk to us. Except for I see already that the, the string, the wire is broken. Hello, Monty. I don't expect you to talk, but I know you hear me in spirit. All right, guys, look at this. We do have some ghost face things here. We have the blue, we have the purple, and we have the viper face. But that appears to pretty much be it, except for the devil face dead by daylight costume. They got one of those. And ghost face choker. But that is it, man. The ghost face stuff sold out quick this year. All right, let's keep going on down through here, see what else we can find, see if there's anything else that we have not seen yet. Wow, they're pretty sold out of the uh, the Friday the 13th stuff, too. Oh, they do have one Nightmare 4 mask here. Pretty cool. All right, let's keep on moving around here, guys. Wait a minute, look at this. We have the SpongeBob stuff. I always have to look at this. We have Sandy Cheeks here. We have Barnacle Boy and Mermaid Man. And wow, that's about it. Usually they have the inflatable Patrick and SpongeBob in this section too. They do have the inflatable Gizmo over here. That's cool. And they have the Gizmo half mask, but I don't see Stripe. All right, let's keep on moving here. I wonder if we would get lucky enough to find a shrunken head in this store. Looks like no would be the answer to that. I don't think they even put them out this year, guys, or else I would have found them in one of these stores. This is the 86th store that I have filmed across the United States this year, guys. All right, before we go, let's just check out these inflatable costumes quick because I'm curious. God, I love these things. <laughs> they're so cool. I think they're some of the most creative costumes in here. The inflatable eggplant, the balloon animal. I love that one so much. The uh, the inflatable sumo wrestler, the party pooper. I, <laughs> breathalyzer, that's cheesy. That's not even inflatable. But I was wondering if they had SpongeBob and Patrick, and I don't see them. They do have this broken doll mask, which I'm not sure that I've seen before. That is actually pretty cool. And this girl reminds me of the girl on Scary Movie. Okay, guys. I think that's pretty much it. I don't see anything else that we haven't really seen except for this tiny little queen crown. How hilarious is that? I don't see any other... Uh, secret keeping cats. I don't see any creeping cats. We saw the one secret keeping cat, but that was it. They do have the one-eyed baby on a stick. And they got a lot of masks, but I do not see Michael Myers. I don't see Halloween 2018. I don't see Halloween 1. Wow, that's it for the mask section right there. Hmm, strange. Still curious where that chainsaw sound is coming from. It's somewhere in here, but they've got it hidden well, so. I do like this rotten pumpkin guy. Let's see if we can, no, I think he just lights up. I don't think he makes any sound. He just lights up, but he is pretty cool. Let's look around this real quick here before we go, because I'm just curious if they have any of the uh, bag clips, because I haven't seen any around the store in other areas. Things are set up a little bit different here in this store. Hello, rats. And I do not see any. All right, I guess that's it for this store, guys. Absolutely enormous store. If you need pretty much anything, come down to this store because it is huge and there are not a lot of people here. So they still have a lot of things in stock. All right, guys, there we go. Spirit Halloween in Middletown, Ohio, store number 86. We got 14 more to go. Stay tuned, because we are gonna hit them all before the season is over.